What is going on, Karasuno family? My name is Mike, and welcome back to another Karasuno TV episode. Ladies and gentlemen, it's Sunday. It's time for Mushoku Tensei, uh, episode four. Um, Mushoku Tensei has been a shocker to begin the season. Uh, you know, we are now three episodes in, and it's been just pure quality from Studio Bind. You know, we already had a good idea that the source was going to be some strong material, um, but... I didn't think that the adaption would just look this beautiful. I mean, everything is brought to life so elegantly, and it's just so fantastic. I, it's so easy to immerse yourself in this world when the magic is, you know, the colors are flying everywhere. These beautiful, gorgeous backgrounds, these landscapes. Um, so, I've been having a blast with the show. Um, we're on to episode four. You know, last episode we meet a new friend of uh, Rudy's, and, you know... He sort of has this little growth period, uh, you know, obviously just finds out she's a girl, right? You know, goes through that that, that little phase. I I'm interested again in seeing, I made the comment at the end of the last episode, I want to see Rudy, you know, sort of expand his ba barriers a little bit, you know, and sort of branch out. Uh, I don't know how long he's going to stay, you know, at the house, but I want to see him, you know, travel, right? Travel to the next town, right? Start the, start the grand adventure. He is young still, so, you know, there, there is some, there is some validity to that point of him staying home. But regardless, I want to see, you know, I want to see more of this beautiful, gorgeous world that we've gotten so far. Um, but yeah, so, uh, you know, Mishoku Tensei, episode four, to start the day. Obviously, Kemono Jihen normally goes first, but got up a little bit later. So that's going to be after this one, and then Attack on Titan, of course, rounding out the day. Um, before we get into the episode, guys, though, subscribe to here on the subscribe to me here on YouTube. Go follow me over on Twitch. That way you stay up to date with the content on both platforms. Patreon link's going to be in the description. Go check that out. Best way to support me and to get exclusive rewards. Lastly, come join the Discord. Best place for discussion, announcements, and everything in between. Thanks so much, guys. Seriously, for all the support. Can't wait to see you in this next... I don't know what I'm saying. Guys, Mushoku Tensei, episode 4. Let's fly, guys. Oh! The family's growing. Whoa. No way, a second child. A brother a, a, or a sister? No way. It's Paul. Oh my goodness. I can't believe our boy Paul. No way. I did not see that coming. So he's going to have two new siblings, basically. I can't believe Paul admitted it straight up, too. Like, right away. He didn't hesitate. Oh, look at Zenith, though. She does not look like she's taken it well. Dang, the very quiet. I forget. I forget the the servant's name, but she's super quiet all the time. I can't believe that. It doesn't seem like she'd be the type of girl. Excuse me, <laughs> the type of girl to get lured by Paul. Oh, she's gonna. She's gonna. Oh, she's gonna take it and go to her hometown. And Zenith is still staying pretty level-headed, too. Look at this this interesting perspective, too, we're getting from Rudy's perspective. The outsider perspective here. He has no idea what's going on. Lilia. Lilia is the servant. Okay. And they'd be walking? No way they'd be walking. She knows about the holy relic, but doesn't tell anyone. That's why Rudy's going to come to Lilia's aid here. Oh! What is he... What? Is he tossing his dad under the bus? <laughs> Rudy! Rudy's planting the lie. He just tossed his dad under the bus. <laughs> oh, this is, uh, he's, I mean, Rudy's spitting facts, but it's, it's still hard for the mother to hear. I can't be you, Rudy, the power. Oh, he's going to hold this. He's going to hold this. We know he's going to hold this over Lilia's head. Oh, and Lilia, did you see that expression on her face too? She knows. Oh, 
But yeah, Lily's expression like lit up. She knows that now she's going to be able to survive with the child. Because things were not looking good prior to that. Like a month, well, a month long journey by herself. Wait, really? It was her? Oh, we're going to get a little... We're going to get a little glimpse into it. Oh, she was getting hot and sweaty by herself. Oh! She wonder if she did it on purpose, left the door cracked. Oh, my lord. Paul just went straight in. He didn't even second guess himself. Goodness. Frightened of him. <laughs> Rudy. Spend my life repaying him. Oh, Rudius. Lord Rudius. No way. Nor and Aisha, they're already born. Time skip, nine months. It's crazy that they're born at like the same time too. They had it too easy with Rudius because he was already a guy on the inside. That's why. <laughs> wow, so they had, they had a fling earlier in life then too. Oh, no wonder why it was so easy for Paul to like snap. Oh, so he respect he respects his dad's strength, <laughs> not really his morals. <laughs> wow, guys, the animation looked so good there too, on that that that, that little swordplay fight, that final roundhouse kick too from Paul. Ooh, ooh, savage. <laughs> He's scum, but I can't tell him. <laughs> uh, Rudy knows. <laughs> Is he finally gonna go to school? Is he gonna go out? He wants to go. He wants to go meet meet people, huh? Try again. No, that's what Paul's saying. But Rudy knows it's different this time. He would not get bullied. <laughs> so maybe he does need to go to school, right? He does need to meet some some other people, maybe expand his horizons, right? When he meet, meets other students, maybe he could, you know, see different techniques or just like, you know, professors, you know, teachers that could broaden his horizons. He's getting the ladies to cry over him and everything. <laughs> <laughs> Paul walked in on him. <laughs> oh, he was having some fantasies with that pillow there. Is it Roxy? Oh my goodness. Um, <laughs> look at the bowl cut, kid. <laughs> Oh, but he hasn't. So she was basically saying she had to try harder. Maybe that's going to inspire Rudy to try harder, too. We're at a whole magic university. Let's go. Maybe he will because he's having trouble. Let's go, Magic Academy. Let's get there. <laughs> Zenith and Lilia, they both kicked him. Oh, so what does he want? To, does he want Paul to front the bill, basically? Yeah. <laughs> Why? What's? Yeah, several reasons. It looks like Zenith and Lily are agreeing as well. Why? Oh, wow! That dedication that Rudius has to Sylphie already, insane. Gonna spend his time making money for her so that she could go as well. I wonder if we're gonna get the job at the end of, you know, maybe at the end of this episode, beginning of next. 
Ooh, is it, is it gonna be... A new character? Rudy's expression, it's gotta be a female. Oh! Yeah, it is! <laughs> Ghislaine, so the SS Island, Ghislaine. Look at her. Oh my gosh, she's... Oh my lord, and just absolutely shredded too, like six pack and everything. Take care of Arudius, he's going with her. He's just tossed, what's he doing? He had to use the magic. He used the magic on his dad, what happened? Where'd the dad go? Oh, he just cut right through it. Why are they sparring? What's going on here? Oh, maybe he's trying to de demonstrate for uh, Ghislaine. Sh show the potential of his son. Oh, Lord. Rudy's done. <laughs> Rudy, I'm glad it's a wooden sword. He got his ass handed to him. Okay, but he, he held his own against Paul fairly well, you know. I guess we could at least say that. But with no, w w without any warning, he's already on his way now. He got thrown into the back of Ghislaine's cart, and now they're moving forward. Ladies and gentlemen of the Kadasuno family, that was episode 4 of Mushoku Tensei, and uh, another great one. So, obviously a big twist there at the beginning, um, you know, with Paul ending up cheating on Zenith with Lilia. Uh, big shocker, but, you know, Rudy comes in clutch, and he sort of talks the situation down. He diffuses the situation. Obviously, Paul still ends up being a... Uh, and Rudy even, you know, realizes through his internal monologues, Paul's still like a scum. He's still a scumbag. But, uh, you know, Z uh, uh, Rudy is still able to, like I said, defuse the situation, keep Lilia in the house, and this might end up helping him later on down the line, you know, with, uh, with uh, you know, Lilia's kid. Um, you know, Lilia even going so far as to say that, that he's going to be called R Lord Rudy. So, uh, but... The main, like, that was great, you know, and it was great to see Rudius, you know, sort of, you know, work his way in there, negotiate the situation. Um, but my favorite part of this episode has to be the end. I love how Rudius is now heading out. He's with Ghislaine, heading to his job. I thought it was going to be the magic school is where he was going to head out first, like outside of his, you know, hometown, his house. It ends up being this work he's doing with Ghislaine. But the episode ends, the car's driving away into the sunset, and that is fantastic. I can't wait to see Rudius explore more of the world, expand his boundaries, get out. Uh, I can't wait for us to see more of the world, too. You know, it's just been so picturesque and beautiful. So that's what's really getting me excited, you know, with this episode and going forward now. Rudy, his, his, his borders have been expanded. He could now branch out and potentially get even stronger because Roxy got stronger and... You know, it seems like Rudy's potential is a lot higher than hers is. So, uh, very excited to see where this is going to take us, guys. Great episode. Looking forward to more. Um, before we go, quick reminders. Subscribe to the YouTube channel. Go follow me over on Twitch. Uh, also, Patreon link is going to be in the description. The best place to support me. So, go check that out. And lastly, come join the Discord. Best place for announcements, discussion, and everything in between. Thanks so much, guys, for the support and for watching. Can't wait to see you in the next one.